Yo, Yo Captain, Captain Mickey, and welcome back to Legendary Adventures. My name is Eli, aka that Big Sauce Gamer Tag. And I'm Becky, aka Small Fry. And we are out and about today in the Dos Lagos area, actually enjoying a little bit of the cooling weather because it's been crazy hot and it's like heat It's still heat crazy storm. hot. It's like 89 degrees right now. <laughs> but it's cooler than like the but 100 the, degrees that it was yeah, earlier. but the sun's down. That's the only difference. Right. Yeah. So now that it's much cooler to play, we can definitely go ahead and get our grind on. And with that said, we have a new battle event to go ahead and do. Yes, go fast battle challenge okay squad so well, here we go for the go fast battle challenge we need to go ahead and power up a pokemon evolve a pokemon defeat a team go run well okay. with, with the whole entire team rockets being able to visit you right now this is actually one of the easier ones where you don't have to go out and about to go ahead and actually find them but you still can so right now that's what we're going to go ahead and hope to do okay so here we go. I'm going to go ahead and be evolving a shiny clam pearl because I still don't have that Goenja one that looks so cool. So here we go. Evolving it. <gasps> no, I need more candies. And I don't think I have any rare candies to go ahead and spend. All right. So that one is not going to be it. That is not All right, you my go-to. I'm going to evolve something really special to me because, you know, why not? I'm going to evolve shiny Yanma right here. Wait, shiny Yanma. Yeah, I have not evolved it. I actually got two, which I was really excited about. Um, I don't know. I just, I really love this Pokemon Yanma. That's why I didn't evolve it. But, you know, dude, that's sick. Check that. That is nice. That's awesome. And then I'm just going to power it up. And then power up. And my first page is complete. Okay, so that means our items are covered. They're good to go. Let's go ahead and claim that first page. The One rewards, rare candy. The rare candy that I needed. Two hyper potions, five revives. Okay, and then okay. another five hyper potions. All right, what's the next page? You need to power Pokemon two times, defeat two gold grunts, and purify two shadow Pokemon. Okay. This is where the purified Pokemon that I've been hanging on forever Will come in handy the shadow you mean the shadow ones to oh make it sorry. purified yeah yes thank you thank you <laughs> all right let's go i'm purifying polywag Ooh, polywag is a great one let's see because um, polywrath is great for pv great for pvp so funny, i'm just purifying purifying it to purify it i already went through that stage where i was purifying like crazy then I regretted it because it took so much of my Stardust. And then I'm gonna purify this Grimer right here. And it's a done deal. Ooh, regular Grimer. Okay, very cool. Shiny Seasley, you guys! Thank you. Oh, I've been wanting one of those forever. Oh my gosh, this one's so so awesome. I love Shiny Sneasel because he's pink. I can finally do the evolution, like so dope. I remember when it first came out, I wanted it so bad. Wait, does that mean you have one or two? I have two. Oh, lucky. Ooh, super bad IVs, but it's so freaking awesome. <laughs> okay, squad, so we've been walking, grinding out, hoping that we were gonna come across one of the grunts. I mean, I came across one of the, the baddies, one of the, the bosses, one of the leaders, and that's great and all, but it doesn't count towards the mission. But Becky finally, finally got the grade. Yeah, I'm battling Jesse right now. I got uh, bombarded with the Meowth balloon. He looks really cool, honestly. Just gonna do this battle real quick. There's no real fight here since it's Ekans. Her second... Super jelly, because I still haven't gotten the Meowth balloon. <laughs> And that's crazy, dude, because this one's probably like my third Jesse and James balloon. So I don't know what's going on there. We've been reading a lot of comments saying that like the same situation uh, that's happening to Eli. So I don't know, fam. All right, going to switch out. Just defeated the Shadow Scyther. And oh, my Mewtwo painted. All right, popping out my Rayquaza, and it's a done deal. Let's see if it's a shiny shadow. That'd be so freaking cool. Okay, so that one did count as a grunt. Okay, cool, cool. So now we know. <laughs> All right, 500 Stardust, one Mysterious Component. All right, let's see this. Almost to 500. 
And is it? Oh, no. no. Oh, all right. Catching this and then on to numero dos. Wait a minute. What happened? So now I'm battling James. Oh, because they attack in two, right? Does that mean that one of them will go ahead and count as two? Was it two encounter? I think it will, honestly. Um, the balloon looked different. It looked kind of purple. And in the day, I think I saw it like regular color, like Meowth color, like mm. that yellow issue. So I'm like, I don't know. But I might be just tripping out. All right, James is popping out his Beldum, which is no match for my Metagross. So these, uh, Jesse and James is really easy to complete and do, which is pretty cool because you can get a shiny shadow from them. So I'm all about that. Okay, so I just defeated James. Let's see, fingers crossed that he gives me a shiny shadow. He's on pissed off. Okay, that one did did count, so my two are done. I got wow. the 500 Stardust, another mysterious component because I do want to battle the leaders. Okay, nine Premier Balls, Rescue Pokemon. And I can't look. I mean, it still looks cool. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> All it's right. cool though. Okay, so my two are done. Okay. Well, in that case, we gotta go ahead and find something for me. Um, plus a restroom, because none of them are open out here, and I gotta go potty. So I'm not gonna go find, well, I have to find a bush. Hmm, maybe there's a shiny Ekans there. Anyways, we're back in a flash. All right, squad. So it is obviously the next day. Um, you know, we got home. It was exhausting. Though when I made it home, I did come across another Team Rocket Grunt to go ahead and knock out uh, that quest line in itself. Well, not fully uh, evolve, um, complete the quest line. Sorry, uh, trying to wake up. Still haven't had coffee. And of course, what do we need to do to complete it? Power up a Pokemon two times. Okay, so a simple power up. What are you going to power up on this one? I'm going to power up. Ugh, what do I have to power up? difficult one all right i'm gonna power up my dialga power up it is a lucky one power up two times 5500 stardust 10 candies which isn't that bad okay, okay considering that i'm trying to max this one out at least so right now it's at combat power 3496 so i have a teeny tiny like bit to go so yeah and for myself personally, I'm uh, actually updating the Rhyperior as I'm using it for the Master League and for Premier League. Um, you know what, it's one of my favorite ones to go ahead and use because it is one of from the original Gen series. Well, I mean, the Rhyhorn uh, Rhydon series was Rhyperior, again, his uh, later evolution later on, but I mean, still has a great spot. It's a great tank, so definitely powering that one up. And then of course, with that said, let's go ahead and complete that All page. Right. 200 Stardust, two Max Potion, two Max Revives. Another three max potions, three max revives. All right, I'm ready to see what what appears. It's Hitmonlee should be. Yeah, Hitmonlee. All right, so Becky, what is it? What is it, Small Fry? Where are we at? All right, so defeat three Team Go Rocket Grunts. So we have two here. So yay, rescue three Shadow Pokemon, which goes with the Team Go Rocket Grunts and power up a Pokemon three times. And that'll complete the Go Fast Challenge? Yeah, that'll complete our part in Team Valor. <laughs> okay, so like Becky said, there's two here. We're gonna go ahead and knock these out and then hope so we go ahead and get visited by another one later on or hopefully before we uh, exit out here. So I got a rock battle going on. What do you have going on over there? Uh, Shuckle actually. Shadow you Shuckle. You know Shadow Shuckle? Yeah, that's pretty dope, right? That is dope. Wait, I don't think I have Shadow Shuckle. I don't, I don't have Shadow Shuckle either. So yeah, this is this is a first. Um, definitely didn't go in with the right team, as you all see. Slawkos is just chilling here. Wait, why? <laughs> Look at her face. <laughs> I say, why? Why? That makes no sense. Because here's the issue: you should have played recommended, but I don't have coffee in me yet. And guys, <laughs> I, I'm the, I don't function without coffee. Like, You're an autopilot. I'm a, huh? I, autopilot is barely hanging it together. Like I'm not, I'm not <laughs> even a Tesla bottle like on that. I'm like, gur, 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 gur. but needless to say, Slawkoth is hanging in there. The body slams are charging up and pushing through. Wait, are they? Yeah, yeah, of course, of course. That's funny. It's funny because it's like, okay, Mewtwo, Mewtwo's doing Hyper Beam and Shuckle's taking it like a beast. Oh yeah, He's well, not Shuckle, surviving it. It's because Shuckle's so tough in defense. I'm like, what? Okay, another Hyper Beam. Oh, I didn't get Hyper Beam off in time. I really hope that they give me Shadow Shuckle because the next one after this was Shadow Larvitar, which I already have. 
so it might be either or. All right, how are you doing over there? I'm still with Shuckle. <laughs> He's taking forever. Switch, switch Slakoth. No, Slakoth hasn't lost any health. Like you guys like can see this, right? Like, just... But it doesn't matter. He doesn't really do anything. All right, I'm gonna not shield. I'm gonna see what he does. This could be bad. You're gonna get defeated. Rock dude. Blast. Rock Blast doesn't even hurt. Dang, so it can take okay. the shadow hit. So here we go. Another body slam. Charging up super quick. Unleashing. And then finally moving on to the next one, which could be Shadow Larvitar. It is Shadow Larvitar. It looks sweet. Another slow, slow burn. <laughs> All right, I'm over here fighting a Shadow Tyranitar, which he was taking Hyper Beam like nothing. So I switched to my Dialga. Gonna go in with Draco Meteor. And that does the trick. All right, so let's see if it gives us Shadow Shuckle here. Hopefully it does. I do like that it gives us um, the Stardust, the 500 Stardust and the Mysterious Component. To be Giovanni, did you guys hear that Giovanni can come through the balloons now? Which that's freaking awesome. I'm waiting for that to happen to me. Okay, is it okay? Yay! Nice! Uh, New shadow acquired. Woo! Love it. Alright, you? And I'm still struggling over here. I got a not the good matchup, I got a side strike Mewtwo against a Tyranitar. So we're gonna go ahead and power it up a couple times. I think I can probably get off another two charge moves before uh, this Mewtwo goes night night, but it's all right because I still have another Pokemon in the back, but still it's not the best setup for it. Um, probably should have thought it out to go with the better counters, but honestly, I I, I I don't know how I missed that Chuckle is one of the shadow Pokemon now. Like honestly, that that caught me off guard right now. Um, pleasantly surprised because you know, it, even though we, we play this game all the time and we try to be informed of everything to share with you guys, you know, there are some things that, that fall through the cracks and when you you do come across it, it's always exciting. It's always like, what? What? <laughs> like, uh, like, oh man. But anyways, going back to the battle, Titar is in the yellow. So, I mean, a stone edge is blocked. My final shield has been burned out and I'm using Shadow Ball against a Shadow Titar, which if you guys are aware, it's, it's, uh, well, how, how do I put it? It looks like that. It, it's not very effective, but it, it is effective. So hanging in there, <laughs> final push, and done. Done? All right, so hopefully, fingers crossed that I go ahead and get that Shadow Shuckle, because I don't have it. It would be amazing to go ahead and have. And uh, here we go. Now, Becky is already working on her next battle, which I got to jump into right now. No, I, I don't reach the stop. I have to okay, go we'll, over we'll move over there. Yes, Shadow Shuckle. Yeah? Yeah, I can't awesome. wait to do some AR photos of this. This is gonna be so cool. Okay, shiny shadow check. Let's do that's this. That's not a shiny. Oh, that is a sh possible shiny. What do you mean that's not a shiny? You just dripped My bad, I, I thought that she was doing a stunky one. I completely forgot that she did the other one. No, you just killed it for me. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, she has to battle James. James. Yeah, so that's pretty dope. Every single time it's like a two shiny shadow possibilities with the team go rocket balloon i do wish it was permanent though like what the heck because um i was telling eli how it's such a great incentive to to keep the game open you know when you're at home just chilling in, in hopes to get a shiny shadow like okay that's awesome in your couch in the comforts of your own home i i wonder if it's gonna be like every month how eli said right no, no, no. Well, it's not every. It's no. not guaranteed. But like, my, my hopes was that it'd be awesome if at least once a month, you know, once a weekend, like we got them coming in to like, to to roll up, sort of like an episode type of thing, where you know you could take advantage of that weekend, let it run, or like that that week, let it run, and then you know you could still take them on, get your chance of a shiny shadow, and then because they do have other great Pokemon in the series, it does open up for the opportunities for them to be to be shiny versions like let's face it we're gonna get the shiny uh bell sprout uh, victory bell it's already been announced so why not be able to get the shadow version of that through james that i think that would be so cool yeah that'd be awesome man. though though sadly we would get the repeat of uh, a shiny wobbuffet or a shiny shadow wobbuffet but i mean that but that... it's a shadow it's completely different and it looks so much better in shadow plus the 20 percent attack boost even though you wouldn't really use wobbuffet but it's just nice to have 
All right, let's see if this gives me a shiny shadow. <laughs> You're just like, no. All right. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, let's see this, guys. All right. Oh, your face is it all. Mm, so sad. Yeah, I thought I want coffee. All right, squad. So with that, we have completed the third page of the GoFest Battle Challenge. Claiming the rewards. Much needed Stardust, as always. And then, of course, the Pokemon that is going to appear. My screen is not the recording because it just crashed. A Super Rocket Radar. So Ooh, that's awesome. that is awesome. And it's Absol. Could have been shiny. Could have been shiny. I still don't have that shiny. You do. Gotta find it. All right. So I, I think that the Go Fest Battle Challenge was actually really fun. This one by far beats the first one that we did for the first week. So I'm really happy about this one. The rewards were okay, but the fact that we were able to battle the grunts and Jesse and James through the balloons that came to you. Epic. It, it just made it like that much, much, much more better. Epic. And I'm so excited to see for what's gonna happen for week three and Go Fest. Stay tuned for our, our Go Fest Elite Challenge video because that's coming up soon as well. And then stay tuned to find out if Jesse and James ever visit me. So we'll catch <laughs> you guys on the next Legendary Adventures. Peace. Peace.